The music is pumping. People are dancing. This could be any nightclub, only it's seven o'clock on a Wednesday morning. These people aren't winding down their night, they're actually just starting their day. My blood is pumping, right? Adrenaline is pumping, so I think it's wonderful. Welcome to Daybreaker, a pre-dawn dance party packed with positive vibes. People are, are focused on, on being healthy. They want to have a good time as well. And right now, there aren't many options for those types of people to really have fun, let loose, and express themselves. The bar is stocked, but there's no alcohol here. Shots of juice, and on tap, cold brewed coffee. There's a DJ, hula hoops, a horn section, a contortionist, and of course, confetti cannons. Dance parties like this are growing in popularity. Daybreaker began in New York City and has now spread to 15 cities around the globe. It grew out of a frustration around nightlife and how nightlife had gotten sort of overrun by drugs, alcohol, mean bouncers, and digital divides, right? Everyone on their cell phones. So we just sort of sat down one night and um, we're like, why can't we do this in the morning? There are no hangovers after this millennial mixer. In fact, most people are heading straight to work. I woke up originally being like, oh, I'm so tired. I don't know if I can do this. And now I feel so fired up and ready for the day. When nine o'clock rolls around, the party is over. But the day has just begun. Scott Lightfoot, CTV News.